Hello, and welcome to the Ruby Princess Vlogs. I'm Favor. I'm Robert. Welcome to our channel. If you're new, I invite you to subscribe. It is Embarkation Day here in Galveston, Texas on the Ruby Princess. We are very excited to be taking a seven-day Western cruise here on the Ruby Princess. We are it is now 12.55. We have been on board for a couple of hours. And so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take you back to when we first took one little tiny step onto this ship and getting us into the port, into onto the ship, and then straight to lunch, all the way to the point where we get right back here in the cabin. So thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for uh, watching this vlog series. This is day one of our seven day cruise and we will see you around the ship. So right now, all the way back to the first sighting of the ship in the car. Hello, Ruby Princess. Oh, you are so beautiful. I cannot wait to get on board. We are now heading to park the vehicle. We booked through portofgalveston.com. All the information will be listed down in the description box for you. It is right there, right there. It's easy to walk right across the street from the parking garage. It is indoor covered parking garage parking. And again, all the details are listed down in the description box, how much it cost, as well as right here on the screen. It was very easy to park. It was quick in, found our parking spot, and uh, just simply walked right across the street. You can see we're waiting to cross the street here. The parking garage is right there. It's very easy to get right across the street and over into the cruise terminal. We were in terminal one. The crosswalk is at terminal two. There are many, many parking options. Uh, I will leave two listed down in the description box for you. We just pulled our luggage over and uh, you walk along terminal two. Once you get over to terminal one, You'll be greeted by the porters. Thank you so much. Yeah, Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. They will take your luggage. Don't forget to tip. And once they take your luggage, you can walk on past all of the crowding and all of the people dropping off their luggage. You just walk past and get down to the entrance to the terminal. Once inside, the first stop will be your security check. They will check your passport and your boarding pass or just your medallion. They'll look at your medallion. Then you'll go through security right there very quickly. And then you will make your way up into your official check-in through the little ramp here. You'll enter into this room and that is where you will officially check in. Then you will follow the group all the way up the escalator to the waiting area. This is the waiting area. We had about five minute wait and then we were told to board the ship. Very quick, very fast, very efficient. No complaints whatsoever. So you'll walk along this little ramp hallway here and head to the gangway where you get to board to the ship. There's Ruby Princess. There was a little bit of traffic here, no big deal. We got on the ship within a couple of minutes. Here we go, we are almost on the ship, almost, almost, we're almost there, and we are on the ship, yay! Good morning, thank you, all right. That was muster, right there when you check in. All right, so where to, Robert? Food. <laughs> Robert is hungry, so we are going to go up to Lido. Go up to Lido Deck 15. All right, we are on Lido Deck 15. All righty. Find a snack. There is the salty grill right there. Okay, and here's cones, uh, coffee and cones. Pizza. He says to come back around noon. It is 11.45. He is making the gluten free. Dope. Uh, yeah. I'm excited. This is where we are. Hello. Hello. Very well. Thank you. 
Thank you. I know that many of you may have sailed on cruise ships before, but here on the movie, we've streamlined it ourselves, which can be accessed through your phone in the Medallion Class app. And step three is listen. Okay, the buffet is a little tight. So when it's not so crowded, I'll take you through. I gave you a little peeks here and there, but I really didn't want to stick my camera in between anybody or near their food. So I picked up some fruit, some Italian meats, and a hazelnut dessert, which was labeled gluten-free. So that's much appreciated. So we're gonna join Robert and have a little lunch and wait for our cabins to open. Robert got a dog. Oh, I didn't glue, I didn't film your pizza how was it it was very good very good okay we'll have more pizza i'll show it and robert got a couple hot dogs and look he brought me some good french fries yummy my lunch was delicious now i'm gonna have some french fries and maybe some pizza <laughs> Here is my gluten-free pizza. Oh my goodness, it looks delicious. It looks very similar to the crust on uh, Sky Princess. So I wonder if it's the same. I'm sorry, I wonder if it's the same. So I'm very excited. This is a Calabrese pizza, which I love. I'm so excited. So, oh, sorry, honey. But some, I didn't know it was gonna be so loud. Some cheese is on there. It's okay. Some cheese is on there. Of course, I already had French fries. And this is where we got pizza. It's sliced pizza. Delicious lunch. Here's the pool on an embarkation day. It's kind of chilly here in Texas today, in the 50s. So I don't expect anybody in the pool today. So there's a little confusion on muster. The announcement said we do need to go to our muster station, but at check-in, he said we did not. That he was scanning us into muster. So we're going to our muster station just to make sure. So it's nice to know where it is, just in case. <clears throat> Good morning. And um, that way we can not be the people that delay the ship sailing. I'm not gonna be those people, hashtag go to muster. Okay, we are full aft and here we are in the buffet. There are three separate sections to the buffet. Two on either side in the middle and then here in the aft. So here's just a quick peek. It's not as busy back here. Just a quick peek. I don't want to be in anybody's way. This is a Philly cheesesteak sandwich and french fries. And then over here we have desserts. Well, we have some steamed vegetables and some eggplant curry. There's some different options. These were all available in the mid buffet as well. And fruit selection couple of different soups over here. Fish chowder and Tuscan garbanzo bean soup. I don't know, it says coconut lemon mousse, but that is most definitely not lemon mousse. That looks like the hazelnut. And this is a coconut pie, sugar-free. And then a fruit tartlet, delicious looking. Peas and carrots, chicken cacciatore. A couple of different sandwiches, uh, grilled vegetables, salami prosciutto cheese different options there and then back around to this and the Italian meats and cheeses. Straight through these doors, <laughs> wherever they are. Oh, it's very chilly. Is the aft pool and the aft views. It is <laughs> quite the busy pool, let me tell you. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go run to our cabin. The mugs are plastic. All right, wait, no decaf for me, please. I'm very glad I brought my own sugar. I'm not a big fan of either of these, but it'll do. Coffee's pretty good. All right, we have no idea what our cabin number is, but <laughs> it's in the 300s. But when you walk by, when you approach it, you just touch your medallion or you get near it and it will light up with your name. So we'll know when we're at our exact cabin. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> All right, so we'll see when we get down there. See, we passed by and it unlocked the door for us. Turned on the lights right as we get in. All right, quick little room tour. I don't do formal room tours anymore, so let's get that going. We walk in the door right here. We have our nice big closet area. Shelves in here of safe. Uh, I don't think my laptop will fit in there. I have a 13 inch MacBook Pro, but I'm sure your iPad will fit in there. Most people don't bring their big laptops. I just have to work. All right, here is <clears throat> the shower, the sink, the toilet, 
everything there you go there's favor Michelle put there with our life vest and a full length mirror right here remember I did tell you it's chilly outside here we go here is the cabin we have queen beds and we have lamps on either side no USB ports we do have a table and this corner unit with a refrigerator right there we have some glasses and then more shelving up here we do have a plug up here that's nice and a plug two plugs over here very nice very nice a nice hair dryer uh, probably not for me a desk and there you go cabinet in there let's give this a whirl press okay oh yeah definitely not gonna work for me I mean it's nice and hot but that is not going to work for my thick hair okay and then here is our balcony oh look it's got the oh that's nice we do have a light for the balcony which is appreciated all right, that's, that's locked. Oh, it's just one, okay. Very large balcony, nice. I love when they have this down, keeps it nice and dry. There you go, okay. So you can see we have a double door. And this is the length of our patio. Lovely here in Galveston. We are on the, that's Galveston over there. There is the, uh, Oh, I can never remember the theme park over there. Alrighty. Now let's go let Robert in. Oh, there's the Princess TV. Great, great, great. The Medallion app is fantastic. Welcome back. We just did a quick little room tour. <laughs> Were you stepping back? Yes. No, sorry. <laughs> we just did a quick little room tour of uh, Ruby Pr of our cabin here on Ruby Princess. Uh, currently, we are going to go down to the muster. It, there's a little bit of confusion about muster. We're not quite sure if we need to check in or not. They keep making announcements that we need to check in. But then when we checked in, when we got on the ship, they scanned our medallion and said that was our muster. So I'm not quite they sure. They weren't clear. Yeah, it wasn't they just clear. Said, yeah, your muster is this floor down at the back. He didn't say specifically, you need to go there. Well, and I asked. And yeah. he said, no, you're scanned in now. But yeah. we're going to go just to make sure. You should always really be familiar with where your muster station is. Yep. Just in case. Worst case scenario. You never know. So there we go. Um, so that's what we're going to do. We had a delicious lunch. We will probably not be having dinner. Probably not. So there is one thing that I have not mentioned, and I should have mentioned it at the beginning of this video. Along the screen in every one of our cruise vlogs, you will see as much information as I can possibly put there. Ship maps when we're out, out and about around the ship, restaurant menus, dinner menus, things like that. I will put that as much as I can in our cruise vlogs. Now, if we are going to dinner in the dining room or at a restaurant, I will put the menu while we were at the, while we are at the restaurant. If not, you'll see it at the beginning of the cruise vlog and I'll usually announce, "Hey, we're not going to dinner today" or whatever. So, there you go. Sometimes you just have to hit pause if you have yes. to read. Yeah, cuz I can't if I let it go as long as it takes and I don't speed it up a little bit, well then you're going to see that dinner menu all the way clear into, you know, 10 minutes it's into the vlog. 73 so. minute vlog. Yeah. So, okay. Again, I'm Favor. This is my husband, Robert. Welcome to the Ruby Princess Cruise Vlog Series. This is Embarkation Day. Now let's get this cruise started. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Okay. So when you walk by, the, the light turns on, which is both good and bad. <laughs> if it's 3 a.m. and somebody's, you know, using the lavatory, it's not so great. <laughs> All right. Let's go find our way around this ship, shall we? Okay, we are here on deck seven. We found the stairs a little faster. Ooh, here's all the people. Let's try this direction. We are looking for our muster station. So Crooner's Lounge and Bar, which is where they said it was. Muster Station C. So when we checked in, we were in our Muster Station. 
That's why we didn't have to go anywhere else, but you would. <laughs> so we're on deck six, and of course here's the Princess merch store. Uh, we'll walk through this. You'll see that in the sneak peek. So if you're interested in what's in the different shops and stores, you'll have to watch the sneak peek. And I will leave that linked up in an iCard for you and down in the description box. So, all right. They're not open yet because we are still in port. We are in the International Cafe where you can get coffee. And then, of course, treats. So we have the different treats. There's that hazelnut mousse I had earlier delicious so typically the desserts that are in the buffet are here as well you can also get little mini sandwiches and uh, salads and things like that and uh, typically if you're gluten-free you can just ask for something and they will make you a salad or a sandwich or something but caprese pesto yum and then over here we have a couple of hand pies and a quiche looks absolutely delicious well i mean it is a cruise so I wanted to go ahead and give it a try. Mango cheesecake, gluten-free, hazelnut mousse, again, because it was so delicious the first time. And then a latte. Delicious, we do have the drink package, the sailing, both of us. Well, a very good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome on board, Ruby Princess. If you are ready for a great vacation, Uh, we did catch the horn, but it is not the love boat horn. So in one of our lives, uh, in our live, not one of, in our live, uh, which I will link up in an iCard for you and down in the description box, it was mentioned that the love boat horn is only on the newer ships. So regal class and above. Re regal class and above. So perhaps. So we will have to see because we will be on Regal Princess when she comes to Galveston. So we haven't booked it yet, so I don't have a sale date for you. But um, anyway, we are now headed down. We are on deck 11. Uh, we needed to be on 15 because I need something to drink. So I won't make Robert take the stairs again. We'll go up in the elevator. <laughs> Sorry, Robert. We're still learning the ship. Deck 11's our, our, our deck. <laughs> Anyway, so we're going to run um, up and get something to drink and then just kind of explore a little bit. Well, here's the casino. It is not open yet. But this is the Gatsby's Casino on Deck 6. We do have some free play, I believe. A speakeasy. All right, we're going to grab a little snack in the buffet and head on off to a show. Pardon me. It's chilly outside. So uh, we're going to run through the buffet and then head to a show. Let's see what you can see. I'll try it now. I always come back for another one. Sandwiches. Salads, meatballs, meatballs, olive salad, fruit, desserts. Nothing listed as gluten free. Potato salad, 
Yeah. Robert got some sort of cheesecake. Lemon cheesecake. Lemon cheesecake. And then some pizza from Sliced. Yep. So I may have a little snack later. I don't know. But I had a huge lunch and um, I'm just really not feeling hungry. So. So I'm gonna go ahead and run the menu for tonight's dinner along the screen here. It is in the app, and a lot of times Princess Online has the menus, so you can kind of take a look and see what the different offerings are. But since we didn't eat in the dining room this evening, I'll go ahead and pop that menu up on the screen here for you, so you can take a look at the options for tonight. Here is the Princess Theater. We are gonna go in for a comedy show. We're a little early, but we didn't know what to expect as far as crowds go, so let's see what we have here. Let's go Dive into the deep blue sky Come with me to paradise Can't you hear it calling us? Got a spot for your elbow and your drink Please welcome your cruise director, Mika Raitano Alright, alright, alright oh, Thank you very much ladies and gentlemen Thank you, thank you, thank you Very good evening folks, welcome to the Princess Theatre for Showtime tonight Ladies and gentlemen, without a doubt, please put your hands together for the comedy, Mr. Michael Joyner! Stop it, I'm married, I'm not used to praise. <laughs> Robert and I both, you saw in this vlog, we went all over the place looking for our muster station. We watched the video in the app. I don't want, we just got a letter in the cabin saying we didn't do our safety. I, I don't. <laughs> and the one lady told us the wrong muster station. Right, so we went to the other one and then he was like, no, that's where you need to go. So we went there and then we went all the way down the, the thing and it was where we checked in when we got on the ship. And so we asked again. So there's some confusion with the muster stations and I'm not sure why, but there is confusion. But we did get a letter and let me just tell you, I am gonna go to guest services and clear this up because it's extremely important. Y'all know how we feel about muster. Go to muster. Go to muster. So for us to get this kind of letter is really, <laughs> it, we're gonna clear, we're gonna clear this mess up. <laughs> Anyway, okay, y'all, I know it's early. We've both been up since 3.30 and 4.30 this morning. We're very tired. I late. <laughs> yeah. So um, we have a new uh, foster puppy who is now our puppy. He's ours, and we're just, we're exhausted. <laughs> so he is, he is currently in training. So anyway, all right, you guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Tomorrow and the next day are sea days, and we will combine those into one vlog. So it'll be a couple of sea days for you to see kind of what you can get up to here on a princess cruise during the sea day. Just some relaxation. Yes, we're gonna take it very easy. I'm not taller than Robert. He's leaning and I have heels on. <laughs> so um, anyway, um, we, we are, this cruise, we're gonna take it easy. So you should know that it's gonna be a little more relaxed than we normally are on a carnival cruise or something, but go, go, go. Yeah, we're gonna be relaxed on this one, so. Yep. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you'll subscribe before you go. It is free, and we will see you in the next one. Good night. Good night. Let's go. Dive into the deep blue sky. Come with me to paradise.